Hello, my name is Anand Bin and today I would like to show you a little tool, um, a preprocessor tool integrated in uh, NetBeans HTML, HTML5 project is really valuable. So um, let's start with uh, uh, HTML5 project without a template, without a library, just a plain tool. And uh, then I would like to configure the project. And as you can see, um, there is a pre-configured CSS preprocessor option and I would like to use SAS and say compile and save. And uh, what it means you will see in a second. So um, what I need, I need actually one folder called SCSS. It stands for um, it's a SAS file. And then I can say I would like to create a SAS file. So NetBeans directly supports um, SAS files. SAS are basically uh, CSS files with a little bit more functionality. Uh, I call the style and as you can see you have a basic uh, SAS file and now we would like to set up for instance a section element, um, configure a section element and see the color is going to be red let's say and the uh, color is also red. So and now we have the problem that we have the red color in, uh, in two places. So the solution is not right. And of course, uh, red uh, would be, uh, it is actually fairly easy, it's a basic uh, color, but usually you have to uh, use the you know, um, color, uh, colors from, from your company's um, corporate identity palette. Um, so what you can do with SaaS, I could say actually I can uh, set up and say, uh, uh, let's say air hex red, and it's going to be a beautiful red. So, and this is actually not um, not uh, CSS. This is our SAS capability of using variables. And what's nice here, we can NetBeans is aware of this, so I can actually get a code completion here. So, and now I saved this, and you can see what happened, and a uh, folder CSS was created, and I get the CSS, and now my color is uh, copied here, but this file is generated on save. So if I change uh, the color to, uh, to, let's say, yellow, to a beautiful yellow, um, you will find the difference here, you see, it was replaced. So I think uh, this is, uh, incredibly valuable for larger projects because otherwise you will have to work with find and replace in um, multiple files and SAS and less both is supported uh, in NetBeans so I use pre primarily SAS helps you to um, to organize or to organize uh, CSS better or actually make it more maintainable. So thank you for watching and see you on upcoming conferences, workshops, projects or um, air hacks in Munich Airport um, even with HTML5. So thank you. Bye.